Man can project his mind into the world about him, or into the past or future. The reactions of animals are simple, are limited to the moment. He can see what he wishes to bring to pass, and can set about making it possible. He can live more lives than one. He multiplies himself in a thousand ways. He explores the mysteries of nature, the sources of life, and the causes of death. In all ways, he expresses his thoughts and his desires in music, art, and poetry. He is curious about himself, about nature, about the stars and the waters. About his fellows, about the world before life came to it, about his soul and its fate, about the future of his race. He can bask in the sun after a good meal, just like any animal. But he can reflect on these things that he desires, or curb his desires when they are wicked. He finds enjoyment not only in his immediate surroundings, but in a world of fancy and imagination. forget all that surrounds him, if he will, in a world of imagination into which he can pass instantly. He has found a larger and deeper personality through reflecting on his relation to the world in which he lives. He has learned how to make nature serve him. He has felt the magic and the mystery of the flowers and stars. Of the tempest-driven sea, of the silent pageantry of the summer night. And the canopy of stars. <laughs>